Grab your centering crystals, wargamers, because today on the joy of wargaming, the sun is setting gently over the mountains, the surf is rolling gently upon the shore. Traffic is light, the mood is light, and we're here to help you sublimate your anxieties, center your chakras, and realign your chi in order to bring peace and happiness and joy to the world, but not the joy of wargaming, because today's episode is not for wargamers. Wargamers are an intelligent and analytical lot, for whom the things that go without saying literally go without saying. Unfortunately, this channel is hosted on YouTube, which is a largely open forum, which means non-miniature wargamers have a tendency to show up, they belly on up to the table, misunderstand what's going on, and then smear poo on the walls because they just don't get it. It is a high T bro channel, which means we're a little more aggressive than the average channel that is a little bit desperate to please anyone and anyone that comes by. We take fairly strong positions here, unapologetically, and we have a tendency to challenge each other. A little bit of the numbers, giving each other the business. Not in, an, uh, in, in, an, in a way that is filled with animosity. No, just in a, a good-spirited, good-natured, kind of rivalry sort of way. Um, you know like regular people do. Lately, we've had a rash of, of people wander by and, and they just don't get it and they make comments. And, 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 you know, if you're one of those guys, then I want you to know we're here for you, okay? Look at this lovely scene that we're presenting. If you get all bound up at some good-natured ribbing, you know, like, say, for example, for example, comparing you to a 5th edition... D&D &D player. If that really bothers you, then, you know, that's that's a problem. We need to fix that. So, you know, we're, you're in a non-judgment zone here, all right? We don't judge people. Not here. If you want to be a goof that takes everything way too seriously, if you can't bring yourself to to simp for like an OnlyFans thought and you decide that the best thing to do on the internet is simp for a miniature wargaming rule set bro bro what are you even doing I, oh, I'm sorry I'm not judging you that's a thing that's a valid lifestyle choice I'm going to go defend the honor of milady particular version of a particular set of rules for miniature wargaming hey that's a you thing that you're into god bless you I love you but you get really bound up when somebody doesn't just, you know, tell you how great and special and wonderful you are. It's not the kind of channel where we do that. This is the kind of channel where we challenge each other. Where when people goof up and make mistakes and do things wrong, we, hey, hey, you're doing it wrong. My followers tell me, you know, you missed a thing here, you missed a thing there. Yeah, I do, and that's fine, that's good. I welcome that kind of correction, but it better come from a place of joy from a place of love and a desire to challenge and improve and grow and, and, and become a better war gamer. If you're going to come in the chat with the kind of bad attitude that does not inspire joy, then I want to help you. Oh, Mr. Wargaming is here to help you. And so what we're going to do is we're going to help you avoid all that negativity. You know, it builds up in your belly and all that stress and all that tension, it's just not healthy for you. And, you know, if you want to be a goof, that's good. But you're going to be, you're going to have to go over there. Because this is a goof-free zone. And we want you to be healthy. We want you to sublimate. We want you to take a deep breath. I'm joking about centering your chi. That doesn't mean anything. Your chakras are all garbage. Here, this is what, you know, we're going we're gonna to go say a rosary here, right? You say one of these. You realign your priorities. You understand that this channel's not about you, bro. Okay? We're gonna we're gonna shuffle you off. Maybe we'll give you an opportunity to engage in a little bit of banter, you know, a little bit of test. Hey, what kind of guy are you? You know, oh you can't take it. All you can do is like bind up and offer a snooty well, you know you know, 
stick you snort and stick your glasses further up your nose and point out, you know, you're, you're, you're not being a very nice guy, Mr. Wargaming. Whoa. Bro, let me help you out here. We're gonna kind of shuffle you off. We don't need that kind of infectious negativity. This is about the joy of wargaming. And sometimes the joy is, is sly little, you know, good-natured ribbon. It's part of the joy of wargaming. A little bit of trash talk, a little bit of smack talk. That's all in good fun. When it crosses the line, when it's not in good fun, when it's all about establishing your dominance and your authority here in the house of wargaming, we're just going to send you off. We're going to encourage you. Take some time. Go out into the desert for 40 days and nights. You're going you're gonna to live on locusts and some wild honey. All right, you're gonna wear a, a camel skin robe, and when you when you're ready to come back to civilization, you'll be lean, you'll be mean, you will be a streamlined wargaming machine, and you'll be you'll be centered. You'll be ready for this joy and this wonderful, amazing hobby of ours. Love you. I want what's best for you. We're gonna help you. Be mellow. And be you, because you are, I can sense, you need to hear this regularly and often. You're special just the way you are. You're a wonderful person, and you're going to go be a wonderful person over there if you're not bringing the joy of wargaming to the joy of wargaming, okay? That's how we do things. That's our attitude. Very high testosterone, very bro-style wargaming here. And if, if, if you're a very sensitive soul and you're not prepared for this, we'll help you go off, enjoy the waves, and then you come back when you're ready. And while you're gone, I'll be praying for you.